Yeah, welcome to Kelo TV where we learn how to create a website, how to create game, app, how to learn many things on this channel. So if you're new here, please consider subscribing for more for more new videos updates. So in this video, I'm going to guide you how to publish an app on Amazon Developer Consoles. So you head to the website, you can see it here. You have to put developer.amazon.com you head in there and you create a new account you put in your details and you'll be uh, having access to the developer console so since i have an account let me log into the account so i'm logging into my developer consoles account where you'll be able to upload a new game or app so as you can see i have login so here you can go to the developer console hub here after you have login you will not see anything even if you uploaded game so you go here the editor section where it says developer console okay so from here you can see the list of apps so this is where all my apps are and you can see a new button where it says add a new app so this is where if you're going to add you go here so let me go to the list of my apps on the on the dashboard here so here you can see these are my app published here and all these my app are monetized with admob because this is supported platform for AdMob. So I'm doing this video for some of you who don't know what to do, how to access uh, AdMob, how to place how, because if you didn't publish on the AdMob uh, uh, needed platform, so you won't get any monetization for your app. So this is a, let me take you step by step here okay i supposed to create a new game for you but it's still the same thing because here it's going to give me the same access of what i did while i uploaded this video okay so i have guided you on how to integrate add more code into your hub where you'll be able to download the apk file from app creator 24 which I have guided you. So that particular APK file which you have downloaded, this is where you upload it because I've uploaded already. So that is where you're seeing APK file and this you can see uh, the APK file name. So as you can see, it has been initialized into the platform. The next step is the hub title and which is football life score and which you also need to add your app uh, 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 this one um, that is your app uh, uh, user uh, I don't know I think you should understand this because this is uh, what you're going to link with your with your let me take you so that i won't just be guiding you and you are not getting it so each of the app has a, a unique name which identify that particular app okay so here you can see my apps are all here so this is what i'm saying so each of the app has this so if you create an app on Hub Creator 24 automatically it create this for you okay this is it so that is the package name okay so you're going to copy the package name while you're uploading uh, the same thing with that mob all the package name must go the same thing if not uh, you will get some issues so because uh, this particular uh, package name which I added here is going to let Hadmob knows that yes 
this package name is uh, together with uh, the help I'm trying to monetize okay so here you select the category of your hub so here you can see many categories so you take it there and you can see subcategory you select and here you can see subcategory 2 you can select as well and here uh, my hub is in English so you tick the one for you and here uh, automatically is going to give your login details here and here it will be automatically generated for you after you have put all those details so this is where you have your public key and uh, release ID and that is information for your app so the next and I'll click on next after you finish all the settings you go next okay so this is the next settings so here it's going to ask you to select your the, the type of uh, uh, the devices for your app so my own is a uh, Android and tablet you know can use so here that is where I go so the same thing here it's asking you uh, if you want your app to be uh, to be specific in any region so for me i select all countries if yours is for your own particular country you select here so here yeah, also is going to ask you for target audience which you should know it's asking for the age which you have the appropriate age for your app so my app i selected from 16 to 17 years and 18 uh, above years not less than 13 15 so this is also good you must have to select any of this but if you're going with uh, add map make sure not to select this uh, lower children age okay so here will be marked when you finish this uh, all these settings correctly it will mark here automatically for you okay <laughs> So the next step uh, is going to ask you for the repressive policy. So and for me, I use repressive policy from from hard from upgrade to twenty four is here. It give you automatically. So you can copy it directly where it is. They should be here. I'm going to see. Oh, where, where, where? It should be inside this place. It should be okay. This is it. So you're going to copy it and you put it here. Okay. Okay. So one more thing here. Uh, this uh, rating uh, questionnaire. It's also a. Let me view that for you. Okay. This is a rating. Uh, question that you need to answer it's because I have answered that is why it was covered and marked green because I answered the question correctly okay so I completed the question that's why it's marked so here are the written question make sure you select the appropriate question answers for this because if not your art with had more will have some issues so now here is green violation no okay you can see the rating i said no cartoon no drugs no nudity no sex no sorry for this word okay intolerance you know you mark this academic yes you know because it's um, educational purposes okay so account creation or other personal information okay no no account creation on the hub uh, advertisement yes because i have put the hard of code gambling no location dictation no user generated content no and that is also once i done it's automatically marked it for you now let's move to the next section so the next section is here it's asking if your app is for a speed app or free app so for me it's 
free hub so that is why i mark this so you continue here here this uh this green button complete uh what i did it will not if you're starting if you reach here it will not show you this green it's only when you completed all these uh details so you can see uh display title because i have put it already so it may come here by itself so if if it did not come then you have to put it yourself the same have details and here you can see um the short description long description and then the product features blitz like you know you put the features how it works and all of that and here the keywords of your app and that is all you the keywords comes based on how, what your app is all about so like my own you can see new school score league match all of those things so that is it it so now once you complete it that place you have to mark green if it's not green then you need to check your details and recheck it till it gives you a green button the same thing here this green button comes up only when i complete it this is the most important part of uploading and app. here you have to be serious about this here is my logo my app logo and this is the recommended size so please uh you guys should understand always work by by this if you jump into this video you may get confused while doing this so you have to resize your your logo into uh five five one two and okay by five one two so and must be png so you have to convert it to png that is why i have a a website for you here where you can do all of that for free you don't need to pay anything this is my website my tools website which i created for free for you to use so the second you need to upload this as well that is 114 by 114 these two you have to upload the same and all is png okay now here is asking for the screenshot so you need to have the screenshot of your phone uh, your your app you need to install and have the screenshot of the screen uh, the yes your screenshot of your phone app then you resize it to any of this so you have to work it gently okay let me walk you through if you don't on this site you can come in here where you can see okay here you can see image resizer so here you go you can see 800 by 480 so I'll let it open i'm going to show you yes so you're going to put 800 uh, by 480 so once you've done that you upload the image of your screenshot of the hub here you upload and you click resize you put the the numbers here the width and the height so then you click download it will download automatically for you so you can see it's asking me to do that so so simple you upload it it's uploaded already so you just put the numbers and okay let me give you the example so that it will be a safe i'm just uh, teaching you and we are not seeing what is happening okay so you can see you can now click or resize and you see it has comes up so this is how it works and it download automatically for you so you don't need to go and click download so once you click or resize and download it's automatically you can see it's here so that is how to convert all of this if uh don't be confused so you set all the uh, the sizes so this is it and then come in here you see promotion motional uh, image so i pick one and you still do have to do the same thing and it has to be png or jpg uh, image uh, format so as you can see only here has the option of only png but some has uh, 
so you need to check here has two options you can either use png or jpg uh, format so here is a video you can do screen shot of your video and upload it here in the next one uh, here is app icon for fire tv assets so you can set the same thing and convert it to png so all this can be done with this website for free i have all the conversion you can see png to jpg uh, jpg to png and you can see all the different uh, uh, formats okay here is the background image i resizes the same thing png and jpg and you can see the feature her logo so this is it after i finished uh, after you finish with all this this green button will comes up if if it's not showing green you can uh, upload you can publish it they have it has to be green so you have to do everything correctly before you move on so we go to next so from here uh, it's going to show you the same details that you have uh, done on the website okay so here you can see what i put the description of my everything the hub logo here and you can see everything will be set for you and it will not ask you to you know export compliance you know to accept these terms okay from the amazon developer console so you need to accept this and you see this uh, button submit will be uh, great for you to click for submission so that is how to upload a game on this game or hub on this hub developer console thank you so much for watching if you love this video kindly give a thumbs up if you have any question don't always hesitate to ask drop it on the comment section i will be there to help you out uh, in your journey to build and hub and also to make money out of you know uh, the game we build and the hub we are building thank you so much for watching and bye for now